Seattle woman has the strength of the whole community behind her. Jackie Adams is a single mother with five children. She's battling stage four breast cancer with the support of the entire community. KETK's Nikki Diaz has more on Jackie's story. Casey Chapel Hill and the surrounding communities are fighting almost as hard as Jackie. They're trying to raise the money to cover her medical expenses. Now, last year's softball fundraiser brought in enough money to cover up to a year's worth of expenses, and this year's participants have already doubled. No one can say Jackie Adams isn't a fighter. Last year, she was divorced and left with five kids, developed cancer, beat it. She got it again, and was running short on money. We all as a community come together and decided let's try a softball tournament. Through her community support, Jackie was able to have peace of mind when it came to her financial troubles with her medical expenses. Everything that we raised last year has gotten her through 12, almost 12 months. The funds are getting low, but Jackie hasn't stopped fighting and neither has her community. It's time for round two of the softball tournament, and this year it's twice as big. Last year we hosted this tournament. We only had 10 teams. We did it in about a week and a half, and we were raised, we raised over $8,000 last year. This year, as of right now, we have 18 teams. And there's more donations coming in on top of the softball games. Rangers tickets to Six Flags tickets to uh, softball equipment. Um, numerous things um, and it's all going to be raffled off and every proceed from that will go to Jackie. Jackie's friends were happy to tell me how strong she is and how proud they are of the community stepping up to help her. Just the softball community alone and then you have businesses stepping up and, and donating and helping out and it just it says a lot. And as long as Jackie fights the community will too. It was double last year and that's just that just says a lot. I mean what's it going to be next year? Hopefully this tournament will help you know, keep her alive for another year. Saturday's events will kick off around 8 a.m. There will be the softball tournament, raffles, concessions, bounce houses, and much more, and 100% of the proceeds will go to cover Jackie's medical expenses. Reporting live in Tyler, Nikki Diaz, KETK News. Nikki, thank you.